Welcome back to the Taiwan Outlook. I'm your host Ray Guo. We're continuing our conversation with with Mr. Paul Xu, who is the president of the Epoch Foundation and also the chairman and CEO of FICO's international company. But he's also a leading expert in Taiwan on Taiwan's soft power. And we're continuing to ask Paul to identify for us the third, fourth, and fifth industries that you see the most potential. To yeah. develop Taiwan's soft, you know, mm-hmm. soft power. Yes, Ray. Now the third area, mm-hmm. uh, I would argue that is the、uh, food and the agricultural. Okay. Okay.、Mm-hmm. Now, in view of the uh, uh, the threat of、yes. uh, food shortage、yes. in many corners of the world、mm-hmm. in the future,、mm-hmm. and also in view of the、uh, fact that uh, uh, the food safety. Mm. Is increasingly become important. Yeah, a, a yeah. universal concern. Right. Yes. yes. Right. And、mm-hmm. uh, Taiwan actually has all the technology available. Precisely.、Uh, in、uh, growing food、mm-hmm. faster and、mm-hmm. with a better quality. Yes. And、uh, Taiwan also has a very good standard on food safety.、Mm. Now, how do we turn that into、uh, business models、mm. okay. that can be shared? With the rest of the world, of、mm. course, with reward. Yes. Yeah. So I would argue uh, uh, th- th- the two things that we should uh, 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 be very much concerned、yes. about、uh, help building the agricultural and the food sector、mm. into good business model,、mm-hmm. and also the the agricultural technology、mm-hmm. should be treated as a commodity. Yes. Which can be shared with the world, of、mm. course, with reward. Yes.、Uh, come up with a different kind of licensing program. Okay. And、uh, so I think Taiwan has tremendous strength. Yeah. In, and also in, maybe in those areas. Yeah, protection of intellectual property of rights in the agricultural yeah, yeah, sector. Yeah.、Yes. In the in the old days,、uh, we didn't pay attention、no. of intellectual、no. property protection. No. Because the the government thinks now all we have to take take care of the farmers. Yes. And、uh, we develop technology. We give it. So the farmer free.、Mm-hmm. No,、mm-hmm. if the government choose to do so, that's、yeah. fine.、Mm-hmm. But we shouldn't give the、uh, rest of the world free. That's right. right. That's right. Yeah, you know, unless we <coughs> have some particular charity project in、mm-hmm. mind.、Okay? Yes. Now,、uh, but over the years,、uh, you know, great emphasis has been made in、mm-hmm. the agriculture sector、yes. on intellectual property protection、mm-hmm. and other management and usage、yes. of intellectual property.、Mm-hmm. But we need uh, uh, further effort. To develop those theme into different business model、okay. and income model. Okay. Okay. I think the whole world will be our market. Of course.、Yeah. Yes.、Mm-hmm. Uh, the fourth area I would、uh, argue is、uh, the creative industry. Yes.、Okay? Mm-hmm. Now, in the creative industry, of course,、uh, in the、uh, Chinese language as contained in the government policy, now they、mm-hmm. put in cultural. Yes. But the, in the essence. It's just creative industry. Precisely.、Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now,、uh, this area, I think, we need to do more effort to divide、mm-hmm. uh, the uh, creative idea into creative activities、okay. and creative industry. Okay. Yeah. That's a big distinction.、Uh, yeah. Yes. I think this is a big issue right now. Yes. But in the past, it's all mixed up. Okay.、Mm-hmm. Uh, so I would.、Uh, Uh, encourage、uh, the government sector, private sector, to make a clear distinction between、mm-hmm. creative activity and yes. creative industry. industry.、Yes. In terms of creative activity, government can give away money、mm-hmm. if they want to encourage it.、Mm-hmm. Okay, this is a, more like an educational effort. Yes. But in creative industry,、yes. government should take another attitude.、Mm-hmm. So they have to come up with a profitable business model. model. Again, yes, and uh, inviting uh, investor to invest. Yes, so this、mm-hmm. area we need a lot more effort.、Mm-hmm. We can see、uh, some of the、uh, foreign performing group like、yes. uh, mm-hmm. the、uh, group from Ireland, the,、mm-hmm. Ar- uh, the, the river the dance. Yes, yeah, yeah,、mm-hmm. they are doing very good. Very impressive.、Uh, they are、mm-hmm. industry, right? Yes,、uh, it is a business.、Mm-hmm. Uh, But we look at、uh, many other models in within Taiwan.、Mm-hmm. They are not quite a business. They only、no. uh, creative activities. Yes. 
Yeah, mm -hmm. they largely depend on government support and private sector donation. It can be self-sustaining. Yes, no. but it, it it's hard <coughs> to sustain. Yeah, yeah. Mm, exactly. Mm -hmm. And how about the final one, fifth? Uh, the, the final one, I would say, uh, I say other many many areas. Yes. Okay? okay. But I would take one example. It's Please. our educational industry. Okay. Now WTO yeah. clearly indicates education is a service. Mm -hmm. Education Institute is a service mm -hmm. industry. Mm -hmm. We don't we don't do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we are wrong. We uh, if we have private sector in mm -hmm. education because yeah. there's tremendous business opportunity there. Mm -hmm. For instance, uh, to the uh, emerging market mm -hmm. uh, nation, you know, we we talk about the rise of the emerging market mm -hmm. and uh, we can entertain there are people to come to Taiwan to receive professional education, professional training. Mm -hmm. And we could even set up an uh, institute in mm -hmm. their country yes. to uh, do mm -hmm. education, do professional training. Mm -hmm. But if we don't treat our own organization as a corporation, yes. how, can we, how can we do that? Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think, Paul, in our discussion so far, I think one very important, mm -hmm. I think is very refreshing, at least to me, I'm right. sure for many people watching our program as well, mm -hmm. is the fact that you are reintroducing the most fundamental human instinct right. back into your philosophy or mm -hmm. your theory, mm -hmm. in the sense that you're giving people the incentives mm -hmm. to try to develop, whether it's soft power, high tech, mm -hmm. or is it going to be manufacturing? Mm -hmm. I think that is very important because the you know the sense this you know we we have to have a model you know whether it's business or nonprofit we have to have a model that really drives people forward based on incentives mm -hmm. you know and uh, this is not something uh, a lot of people I don't think are very comfortable in talking about mm -hmm. you know thinking that oh well, I'm not in you know this to make a you know a few dollars and things but I think what is important is what you've been saying all along our program mm -hmm. is that reintroduction of the human you know uh, spirit mm -hmm. you know, of driving forward that you know driven spirit of you know mm -hmm. looking towards a specific goal based on incentives. Right. I think that's very important. Well, well, to be practical, we also need a, a much improved environment. Mm -hmm. Now, how do we improve the environment? Yes. We have several elements to consider. First is uh, uh, government mindset. Yes. So that would dictate mm -hmm. the changing of uh, policy. Yes. And uh, if you say legislature is a part of government, mm -hmm. then we should also influence the legislature to think along the line, to, uh, to pass the law, change the law, exactly. uh, following the change of policy, mm -hmm. and to constitute, uh, to, to, to form a better environment, mm -hmm. to incubate yes. you know, those ideas you just talked about. Yes. Now, we also need a lot of uh, educated effort to the private sector. Yes. Uh, for instance, to industry who have been used to uh, engaging in manufacturing and now find the, the Profit becomes thinner and thinner. That's right. And they should start changing. Exactly. They start thinking about changing business Adapt model. Adapt to the cer yeah. changing In circumstances. Way, instead of cost down, thinking yeah. about how to add value. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yes. So service industry yes. will be also a future. This is in general. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and also, I particularly were, you know, paying attention to two industries that you mentioned. Mm -hmm. One is, of course, on the creative mm -hmm. industry, mm -hmm. and also the other one is on the medical. Medicine, right, right. you know, industry, healthcare, healthcare. Yeah. Yes. So, in those two areas, mm -hmm. I think you know, certainly in my humble opinion, mm -hmm. I really do think Taiwan does have a niche, yeah. does have an edge. Right. Yeah. But do you think the government policy in those areas are doing enough, or what can we do more to yeah. help yeah. to promote those industries? Well, the answer is no. No. Okay. okay. The government policy is not uh, uh, ready. Uh, to incubate these these sector of industry, Ex healthcare yeah. and uh, education. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it, but first of all, government official uh, in the position should re should change their mindset yes. to treat these as industry mm -hmm. and as important service industry. Yes, yes, and yes, indeed. That can mm -hmm. bring Taiwan a lot of new opportunity mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, High added value. Yes, know. and one thing that people often talk about when they refer to Taiwan, 
you know, health insurance mm -hmm. system. Mm -hmm. You know, they think of it as a you know, universal success. Mm -hmm. you know, at least we have universal coverage mm -hmm. you know, for everybody. But um, also we're confronted with a serious deficit problem mm -hmm. in the healthcare insurance system. How can we then maintain, mm -hmm. on the one hand, high quality medical health care, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. and on the other, mm -hmm. uh, reasonable uh, premium mm -hmm. for individuals to pay on a monthly or yearly yeah. basis? How well, can we do both? Well, our health care system, our you know, health insurance system right now, is treating the uh, economically wealthy one mm -hmm. and, uh, uh, and the weaker one yes. alike. Yes. I think there's something footing. wrong there. Yes. So the the uh, the uh, mm -hmm. uh, poorer people uh, have have their resources mm -hmm. shared by the uh, richer people. Exactly. <clears throat> so how do we? Well, I know this is a big topic. This is uh, yeah. <coughs> uh, yeah. very much concerned with the yeah, but uh, 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 votes yes <laughs> uh, in the uh, future election yes. Uh -huh. uh, so I think the politician probably have a different thought. Yeah, a different uh, version uh, of the... Uh, as compared with... Uh, of the as, resolution. Uh, yeah, uh, exactly. Uh, okay. You know. We're going to take another short break, and we'll be right back to the Taiwan Outlook, and we'll, we'll <coughs> continue our conversation with Mr. Paul Shu. We'll see you in three minutes.